We start with Ryan Aber. He is an Oklahoma Sooner football beat writer for the Oklahoman. Ryan, let's talk about the mindset of this Oklahoma team. The Sooners know they cannot afford another loss and still have a chance to make the college football playoff. So what's the attitude surrounding the team this week? Well, I think it's just that, that their, their backs are against the wall. They need this win in order to keep their playoff hopes alive. They know, based on recent history that we've seen the last few years, especially uh, the way that Ohio State came through in the first year of the college football playoff, bounced back from their early loss to make the playoff and eventually win the national championship, that it's possible, but it's not possible without a win on, on Saturday against the Buckeyes. Even the casual football fan who may not follow Oklahoma on a weekly basis, they know names like Baker Mayfield, Samaji Pirine. What non-household name should those fans be aware of and maybe even scared of if they are Buckeye fans heading into this weekend's game? Well, I, I think the one that really stands out to me is Joe Mixon. You mentioned Samaje Pirine, the other uh, running back from the Sooners. Last year, Pirine was a clear number one. Mixon was a, a secondary option. This year, it's much more one and one A. Uh, Mixon had a couple of big plays in that game against Houston, uh, a long pass down the middle of the field. He can do so many different things out of the backfield where Pirine's just sort of the battering ram type of running back. Uh, Mixon is a guy who can do a little bit of everything and allows P. Ryan to stay fresh. So when you, you batter and, and bruise the opposition, eventually he can break that, that big one late in game. Finally, Ryan, from an X's and O's standpoint, where do you see Oklahoma having the biggest edge? And conversely, where is the Sooners' largest concern? Well, I think that the biggest edge that the Sooners have is with Baker Mayfield at quarterback against the, the front seven of Ohio State that replaces a lot from last year, especially those defensive tackles. I think Mayfield will be able to, to find some space and get flushed out of the pocket, make some plays with his feet to keep it alive, make some throws on the run. The biggest area of concern to me is uh, Curtis Samuel matched up against Oklahoma's defense. I think uh, OU showed a lot of vulnerabilities in coverage against Houston, but Samuels does so many different things. The way he lines up all over the field, I think, makes him difficult to keep accounted for. Uh, Ohio State could really take advantage of that on Saturday. Ryan Aber of the Oklahoman. Ryan, truly appreciate the time. Absolutely, always.